WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 2 p.m. update. And currently, we have a mixed bag out here. That mix goes like this. The Dow's up 381 points, a little over 1%. percent s and four tenths or 17 points. NASDAQ 100 is off 1%, 133 points. Russell's up 1%, 18 points. Semi's up 11 points. That's three tenths. Tranny's up a uh, little over 2%, 332 points to the upside. Gold's off four bucks. Silver down 13 pennies. Lights Recruit is up 65 cents. Natural gas back 23 cents and it's the Dow that we're going to begin focusing in on why is that well if we take a look at the index ETF the DIA we can see that price is trading right into resistance is this the end of the move? I don't know. What I can share with you it's also trading into a swing point and that's a swing point from the trading session of March 29th and that swing point has volume of 4.71 million shares. It's two o'clock and it's already at 3.2. So it does look like the Dow Diamonds are going to have the volume. And that says if we see a close above 353.71, you're going to have a confirmed A to B equals CD to the upside out there. That would give you an initial price projection of 372.02. That is not where price will stop, or that is not likely where price would stop. What do you mean, Steve-O? If you look at the retracement here, the B to C leg, it's a 41% retracement. If, in fact, we get a close about 353.71 with volume, that is a strong move up there and says that likely this does more than a 1 to 1 A to B equals CD. So your targets would be 380 and 391 inside of the Dow Diamonds. Of course, that gets us back to new all-time highs out there. So the Dow Diamonds really are the thing to be watching today, or at least one of the things to be watching today. If we go take a quick peek at our indices out here with the next 30 seconds to see if there's any signals that they are providing to us, well, we can begin by taking a of the Dow. It's above its green oscillator and change line, takes out that swing point, and it takes out the 35,431 level. Now, this is the Dow Cash Index out here. That would be another confirmation of an A to B equals CD to the upside. The S&P is above its green oscillator and change line, suggests move to 46,03. The NASDAQ 100 is struggling, suggests it wants to go back and retest the lows. Russell 2000 wants to go back and test the 2150 area. The semis look like they want to continue to move higher out there, uh, but it's a red oscillator and change line, so it's not as as certain the Dow transports looks like they want to continue to move higher. New York Stock Exchange should go target 6932. Folks, stay tuned. Your favorite polar bear is up next. Have a wonderful Wednesday. I look forward to seeing you tomorrow on Terrific Thursday, one o'clock sharp. Take care.